Hello guys, uh, here is another review video. Uh, I, I wish you would not be up here. Last review, I had peanut. This one I have my chubby pipe. This one is going to be, as if you read the title, you got a camera? Tell mine. She wants to go. It, I don't even know what type of night it is. I'm, re I'm actually recording this one right after I record the other one. I'm just trying to get some videos out because I know at some point next week I'm going to be helping my grandpa put up a wall. And he's the one that's having all the troubles. Um, and, and sorry if you hear stuff in the background. Dad's watching Futurama in the living room. <laughs> he's crashing in there. Um, today we're doing the 2014 Ninja Turtles movie. Now, when this movie first came out, Oh, Sorry about the light being in the way. Um, I can't do much about it. I wish I had a lower setting, but it doesn't. If you, this is the stuff I wrote down for the movie. For, when I first watched that movie, I would have been about 11 or so. But it came out in 2014, if I remember correctly. That's why I put TMNT 2014. I grew up with watching the originals. I had them on VHS. I have them on DVD. I don't think we ever got about Bluey. My favorite was the 2007 CGI movie um, because that was the one that came out while I was little. It looked like the Turtles show that was on, which was the you know 2003 show. Um, so when I saw this movie, I remember watching trailers for it. I did not want to watch it. Didn't think I'd like it. And Dad bought it. Mainly, I didn't like it because I didn't like the trailers. I knew who Michael Bay was because of the Transformers. Movies. Um, anyways start the story. For those of you who don't know, April's dad had the turtles. It was try to create and uh, her dad's friend, I don't even remember his name the whatever his name, the, ba the one bad guy with the long hair, was trying to create a virus thing and the turtles' blood was the key for a cure and make big money and the shredder was going to help him do it. Um, and the turtles try to stop it once they realize who April is and the guy is and all that fun stuff. <coughs> um, as you know, they stop it. Now, the jokes. Some of the jokes I got, and I actually laughed at on my rewatch. The story, I didn't like it. Like I said, it was meh. Could have been worse. Could have been better. Just be happy with what it is, you know. Like I said, I'm... References. Some of them I got. Mainly the stuff about the turtles. My favorite reference in the whole movie was the one where the the Vern, I think, is the name because he was named after the news helper from the '80s turtles. I believe his name was Vern. Also, I don't know how it watched the '1980s Ninja Turtle cartoon in so long. Um, he goes, "Where are they, aliens?" She goes, "No, that's stupid." That was my favorite joke reference thing in the movie. Um, next, I'm on. Like, that was my favorite joke, and that's the only one I remember. That's why it's my favorite. <laughs> um, the fights. They were better than I remember. Um, the Shredder versus Splinter one, you know, was kind of quick, so I don't really count that one. But the fight with the turtles at the end that Shredder has. Not the fight with Raph, but the fight at the very end of the movie. I really liked that one. The other fight kind of thing April and Bird had with the foot and cry. And not so much. Um, yeah. um, the design. Splitter's design, I actually, looking back, really like. I like what they do with his tail. Well, I should have talked about that in the fights. You know, he actually uses his tail. That was kind of cool. Um, Shredder's design. I'm going to be honest with you. I like it. In terms of what the movie's going for, you know. Is trying to do something different. I get that. I like it for that aspect. But in my personal opinion, if Shredder is wearing something that armorish, how you want to call it, armored, armorish, he's kind of being a coward in my opinion. Like Shredder's supposed to be this feared guy that could kill you with this this pinky. I mean, that's kind of a coward move to wear something that looks like a transformer suit. Um, the turtles are still a no no. I don't like their designs, especially when Mikey takes his mask off. I remember seeing that. Now, when the turtles, like, I remember being in third grade and getting a Scholastic magazine that would show the books and stuff, and they had an advertisement in it for the Ninja Turtles movie because you can barely see what Leo was. I remember being excited, but once the trailer came out, I was like, no, uh, no, no, no. Um, 
what I was supposed to do. The foot designs I did not like. Uh, but other than that, it was alright. Other things I liked. Raph opening up at the end, I thought that was really emotional, and then I remembered when you know when they fall, and then they just stop on the road. That kind of ticked me off. Um, them tripping from the being their blood being drained and just the morphine shot thing or not morphine adrenaline shot they get that I found really funny um, but that was something I really liked I didn't see that kind of being in the jokes category or the fight because it was kind of you know in, in between um, the elevator scene where they're beatboxing I like that but I would expect that more from the rise of the TMNT movie than this this kind of because of how the rise of the TMNT is. Um, if you guys want a review on that show, if I ever get Paramount Plus back, I'll do it. Um, what else do I have here that I haven't lost? Hold on a minute. Other things I didn't like, uh, look, this is the main one. Like, there's only two things on the, the things that I didn't like that I, could, that I wrote that night. This was, I watched this movie at like 2 a.m. because I was bored. My brothers were home. Um, Shredder not checking both times when he killed the fight in the sewer. Shredder just kind of leaving when he captured four of the brothers and didn't make sure Raph was dead or that Splinter was dead. I thought that was really stupid. Then, when he beats um, Raph the second time, he just kind of walks away again. Why? Why wouldn't you make sure they're dead, especially if you're supposed to be this fearsome warrior? Um, and then... The other thing I really didn't like was the origin story. How it tied into the, you know, plot, at least it tied into the plot. Um, other than that, I found it like, really sucky. I'm thinking when I put the, you know, like the poster type thing I bet did with the Space Jam video, I think I'll put over this light. That way it's not blinding people when they watch the video. Um, but other than that, I love the movie. Looking back on it, it is definitely better than I remember. I mean, I laughed at it. Uh, and like I said, I was super tired when I watched it too. There's other stuff I probably should have took notes on. But I didn't. My phone was about this and I was tired. It took me two days to watch the movie because um, I didn't finish it the one that I was like, I only had like 10 minutes left. I was like, you know what? I'm tired. I'm going to bed. Um, I have HBO Max so I can do the original movies plus the 2007 movie if you guys would like me to. If you guys want more reviews, like, comment, share, turn on post notifications. Um, rate, skirt, subscribers away from 50 subscribers. Let's get the subscriber count up, baby. Woo, woo. Um, I'll try to keep doing these videos. If you guys are wondering why I'm drinking, it's a kickstart, it's Mountain Dews. Energize, drink. They have they have these at our circle K. I like the grape one, which I got a grape one safe for tomorrow because I'm going with my grandmother. That I'll try to vlog that. Um, I'm trying to think what else. Yeah. At least this one's longer. It's not six minutes, it's eight minutes at the moment. Hope you guys like this. Like, comment, share, subscribe, go turn on post notifications, go follow me on Instagram, it's my YouTube, it's my YouTube. go follow me on Twitter, it's my YouTube, it's my YouTube. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.